Hey everyone, how you going? This video is the uh, maiden flight of my FPV Raptor from Hobby King. As, um, as you'll see right at the start here, uh, with the uh, stock motor, I have to go full stick basically to move it off the ground. I do have a Hero uh, 3, the Silver Edition um, GoPro attached to the front as well. Um, I am running a um, Tenergy 55 amp plus um, ESC um, uh, as opposed to the one that comes with uh, the 30 amp stock. Um, I do have another guy flying with me here at the moment. Um, he's flying the same Raptor. He's actually got the um, yeah, stock um, ESC on it. However, he has adjusted it so it's sitting on the outside of the fuselage um, just for better ventilation. Um, it's been probably a week now and uh, we've flown a few times uh, since this maiden flight and yeah he hasn't blown it up yet however he said it, it does get really hot and if it had been inside the fuselage it would be uh, toasted by now we would think um, so other than that everything's stock as you can see it's it gets a bit rough up there I'm not sure how windy it was at the time but it is my first time flying such a large glider plane. Um, I'm normally used to playing a little 3D uh, foamy. Um, I've only been flying for about um, four to five months at this stage, so just getting used to it. Um, soon you'll see the uh, another Raptor come into the shot. Um, and that's a uh, yeah, Lens Raptor. Um, hasn't put any stickers or anything yet. <laughs> He's just plain white. Um, they do fly really well. Um, I was quite surprised how well they glide actually. Um, you'll see at the end of the video, I just overshoot the, um, the landing and just, it just would have glided forever, I felt like. Um, um, but the engine, I'm already thinking of probably upgrading the engine. It's, it, it doesn't seem to have as much oomph as I thought, um, especially if you put FPV gear on it with the, the camera loaded up and all that sort of stuff. Yeah, you'd probably want something a bit bigger. Um, again, I've already, I've already got the upgraded ESC on it, so it probably wouldn't be too bad. Um, this is parts of Wagga Wagga here as well. Um, we just fly in a local um, sort of touch footy field. As you can see, all the fields underneath are all um, line marked. Um, it's a nice day for it. It's, a, yeah, it's fun stuff flying the planes. Um, However, we probably find somewhere else to go and fly, so we're not so much over the um, people's houses in case one of these servos go. Um, I've still got the stock servos in it, haven't actually upgraded yet. However, we might put a, um, a stabiliser um, on the plane, which m may uh, encourage us to get um, some metal servos on this thing. But stock ones so far have been good, haven't done as. Um, any cars and causes any problems. Um, another thing um, we've done on these planes also we've just put the flaps on it. We're actually flying with flaps. You'll notice when we come into land um, you'll see when I switch them on the plane sort of immediately um, noses up and uh, didn't seem to slow me down as <laughs> that much though. It just gave me a lot of lift. Um, Previously when I've been flying, um, especially on a windy day, and I was running out of battery, I went to land and I was getting really close to some trees. I actually used um, the flaps to um, get lift and it actually got me over the trees, which was a really good thing. Um, it helped out a lot. Um, well, the video basically just keeps going on. You'll just see um, myself uh, following Len or trying to follow Len with his Raptor. Other than that, you could probably um, skip to probably um, 9 minutes 40, I think um, that's about right. There's a, a hawk that um, comes up after me and uh, just follows me around. I tried to get him on the camera, but it was really hard, obviously, without FPV. Um, and uh, with the FPV, I've had um, Len, uh, the guy who I'm following here in the shot, uh, he's got the fat shark goggles and he's already used it on the plane and he said it was really fun with the um, plane so um, if you're into that sort of stuff um, I'm sure the plane will be 
well and truly, um, yeah, able to carry all that stuff and give you lots of fun. Anyways, um, yeah, feel free to watch the rest of the video or skip to 9 minutes 40 and um, check out the landing, um, which wasn't uh, perfect, but uh, since then, been able to work it all out and I'll have some more movies um, uploaded um, soon. Also, this is captured at 1080 um, by uh, 30 frames per second, as that's as high as the uh, Silver Edition on the GoPro goes. Um, my other videos have all been um, captured at 720 by 60 frames per second, um, and I've heard that the GoPro Black Edition, um, 1080 by 60 frames per second, looks uh, really smooth and um, yeah, just looks awesome. Anyway. Like I said, feel free to enjoy the rest of the um, clip. Um, it's not perfect, it's not great, but I figured I might get it up here so at least um, some mates can check it out. Bye.